guys, I received a letter from Barwa's lawyer <laughs> for defamation of character. <laughs> oh, guys, I need a lawyer <laughs> because Barwa came for me. <laughs> I don't know what to do again. <laughs> International police is looking for me everywhere. It's tap wall. <laughs> Modest Lifestyle, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Modesta. Do well to join the family if you haven't. My returning subscribers to Modest Nation, I see you. Oh, I see you. Yes, I see you, Koro Koro. We are back from our 24 hours vacation, if you know what I mean. 24 hours free of drama 24 hours free of gr -gr 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 -gr. like there are people who say 24 hours free of saga hey i really enjoyed it and you guys even made it special for me by turning up hey they said that all we do here is we talk about people pulling people down hating people for nothing ah you guys again prove them wrong thank you so much for watching that yesterday vlog I truly appreciate all of you from the bottom of my heart. Yes, it's a reaction video. Who made it to the table? You and I. Thank you for clicking in. Thank you for coming back to support this mama right here. Grab whatever that is grabbable. Me, pardon me because this thing will be going down small, small. As we are just in. you know what time it is. Open that fridge, grab your own now. Fruit, salad, water, anything, anything, wine, depending on the mood, you know, you know what I mean. Most of you guys know yesterday is my broker free day, and I really enjoyed that moment, you know. I don't have to get up 4 a.m. in the morning to start talking to myself like a mad woman, guys. Before I usher in the people we have on the table today, I want to do a small recap, okay? Max 1 million responded to my reaction, me telling him that I've washed my hands, and he responded. But before we talk about him, I'm not gonna like bring his clip here, I'm not gonna do too much talking about all he said, you understand? He's trying to still prove that he was really wrong. Nobody is doubting that one. I never said that he was not wrong. The only problem I have is the fact that he didn't tell his wife. And the story was going higgy haka. It didn't make sense at all. Everything was off. Everything about that story did not make sense to me. Me. Okay? Hey. <laughs> now, you audience, you lazy gang, you non-lazy gang, that watched my reaction. Did I ever mention that, oh, you guys should go and subscribe from his channel. Oh, you guys should stop supporting him. I didn't say that. I didn't say support him, not support him, because you know what? We are all adults here. It will be very rude of me. It will be very stupid of me. It will be very selfish of me to come and feel that I can control you. Because I brought someone here and I said, please help. And then, if I'm not happy with what the person has done, which me, <laughs> I'm laughing at people that are rushing, blaming me. Uh, don't you think that you overreacted? In his comment section, I saw some people, you know, pouring out their anger. Oh, what do you expect from an Igbo woman? All she cares is her money. All she cares is her views. Da 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 da. da. Oh, she can't use you anymore. That's why she's quitting. Da, 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 da. I'm seeing all that. Even some lazy members are subscribed. It's good. Subscription is a matter of choice. And that's why I respect Mr. Fruits when he dropped the comment yesterday and he said that he unsubscribed. I didn't come begging him, oh, please don't unsubscribe. Because even if you ask him, don't unsubscribe, he will still do what he got to do as an adult that he is. There are certain things we don't have control over. You can't tell someone what to do. As if you are forcing that person to accept your own opinion and drop his. You guys should fear God. You guys should be reasoning this thing. Miss P is one of my top commenters here. You understand? Even before all this lazy gang thing came up, she has always supported us during Wodemaya time. So she's one person that I respect here. 
Not that I don't respect every other person. Of course, I respect all of you. Even if you are seeing this video for the first time. For the fact that you clicked, I respect you. But I respect her because she has been there. You understand? Through thick and thin. Now, I don't understand her take on this. Number one, she's making it look as if we are trying to tell us one how to handle his family affairs. This is just my mere opinion that if it happened to me, the first person I will talk to is my husband. It's as simple as A, B, C, D. Now, it's left for you to say no. If it happens to you, you may not want to tell your partner immediately. You may still want to hide it. Maybe probably you have so many phones. Your partner may not even know that you lost your phone. That is your opinion. Why can't you guys respect mine? There are so many lazy members here. Lazy reactors that support Maswan and support him begging. On trending during a live stream, told Maswan, if you feel like begging, beg. Did I come after on trending and be like, on trending, I don't support Maxwan begging? No. If not because of this thing that happened now, I will not bring it here. You understand? We are all adults. We are all entitled to our opinions. We carry our opinions like handbag. Now, what makes us adults is the fact that you have yours, I have mine. Don't try to push yours on me. You understand? I did not unsubscribe from Max One. If I tell you how many subscriptions I gave Max One, it will shocktalize you. <laughs> so you guys that are bringing emotions to this, I'm laughing. I'm not going to come here and be reading everything or listening to everything he has said. I was on that live stream yesterday. People have been insulting me. So it's no longer a new thing to me. You understand? Now, coming to me, telling him, don't tag me. The main reason why I say don't tag me is most of the time, now, after he met with uh, A.M. Caro, he started tagging A.M. Caro. But before then, he has always tagged me. And when he tagged me like this, all I'm hearing is, oh, you are paying him. Oh, Modesta Spice, Modesta Spy, Modesta Storm, Modesta Boy, Modesta... It's not like I'm moved with these things. You understand? I'm, I'm not moved because I know who I am. But because of the pattern and what I'm seeing on his channel, I'm no longer happy. If he's going to tag, let him tag everybody. Tag on trending, tag AM Carol. So that all of us will be getting this heat. <laughs> hey, you understand what I did? Because all I did is I shared him like I would share any other person. I'm not the first person that have done something like this. I've never been to Kenya, think of Yabohanse. So I just did what every other YouTuber can do. And you guys also did what you can do for anybody on this space. So why is my own case now, my sister, my sister? Did I say that uh, Max Wang... Is no longer my brother. I even called him my brother. I'm still calling him Max One Million. But does that mean that I will now come if one of our people here says that, oh, I unsubscribe, I must come against that person. Oh, you must subscribe to Max One by Fire by Squad. Miss P, I'm laughing at you because you are attacking the wrong person. Not because he gave him a lot of money. You understand? Even though now uh, I'm seeing him calculating, oh, it's not 300, it's 200. It's not this. You can go and check. You know, you can see these things. You are low-key coming against me. Turning our audience, the audience that me and you share. <laughs> you understand? We share audience. You know how it works, Mass One Million. You know that we share audience. Now, people are coming back. I'm going to put some comments here, okay? These are lazy members. They are coming back now and questioning me. Don't you think you overreacted? Oh, don't you do? You see? So, you are stylishly turning our audience against me for airing my opinion. What I don't understand is, what makes you guys think that because he is Max One, I must not give my opinion? I don't get it. I am not happy. Guys, you guys are talking about, let's listen to Untrending, our inner cactus. As I'm not even looking at this other chihuahua backy backy, because that one doesn't mix that one created her channel for modesta lifestyle so you can understand how terrible she is so i'm not even going to look at what they are saying or whatever i'm just talking about my own 
observation and my own reaction towards Max Wan. He deleted the video that he dropped. That I saw that video. I got the notification that his mom was hospitalized. Why did he delete it? Yeah? And this Miss P, you are covering. Oh, the only time he begged is only one time he begged. Excuse me. You don't have to come here and say, Oh, I need 1,000 reals to go get this for my child. Oh, oh, my mom is this. I don't need to come straight. There are so many ways to kill a rat. When I come and be sharing sorrowful stories here, I go to school, I show you children studying with a torn uniform. I show you children sitting on the floor. I show you all these things. Am I not indirectly asking you for money? I'm asking you, Miss P. Eh? If I run down and tell you, oh, my grandpa is not feeling well, am I not indirectly? I'm taking him to hospital. I'm taking him back to hospital again. Oh, I am not feeling well. Am I not indirectly asking for money? Is that one content? When Mr. Fruit said that he gave him chance to improve, he knew exactly what he was saying. That will tell you that he is a core supporter. He, like he's following him back to back. So you cannot be more Catholic than Pope. He knows why he made that statement. He made that statement because of the pattern. He has gotten used to this kind of content. Let me put it like that. And this is not the first time I'm coming here addressing it. You guys know. So why do you guys expect me now to still continue to swallow this thing? There was a time they said that, oh, I'm diverting all the donation through Max One to myself. And forget about other people that claim that I'm paying him. Most people feel like I want all donation, you know, no, like as if we are siphoning it from Marwa's side to him. Sorrowful stories. Go back to his uh, videos before you come and attack me. Guys, hmm. I have a tricky situation. I was filming with this and I, I lost the button here. Don't be overthinking. If you know, you know, but if you don't know, don't know now. You don't, <laughs> you don't know that the only thing that don't have solution in this life is death. Every other thing, there's solution to it. You guys don't know. So this button is actually to, you know, to open it. I want you guys to see we're on trending a lazy reactor, meaning that we are in one family, right? This is not from Marwa Army. A lazy reactor supported Max One to beg. Max One, I saw that you are helping your papa. If you must beg, beg, no problem. I saw it. I was actually watching that live stream. I said, okay. On trending is supporting Max One to beg. Ah, no wahala, no problem. You understand? This is what I am. Oh, uh, opinion. Max, come and beg, no problem. Ask people. Come out like fellow the boy. It's even better than coming corner cornering. And then when we come out to talk about it, or when we say enough is enough, some people will feel like, oh, but he didn't beg. Oh, but he didn't force anybody. Oh, I can't remember him begging. Like Miss P. You did not see the video where he was asking for a laptop. Mm? You did not see a video where he was defending Mayogno, claimed that Mayogno came to him. And then when we started opening our mouth, he removed the video. And then come up with another video saying different things. Stop it. Don't bring emotions to this. I don't want to block you, honestly. But the way you are taking this thing is not nice. Anyway, guys, let's watch on trending. Max One, if uh, uh, this is just my, my sorry, <clears throat> this is just my opinion. In case you need help, do not be afraid to ask for help because people are asking for help out here. If you need yeah. help, please proceed and ask for help. If you want to say that, oh no, you've come out, you're begging for donation, that is on them. You know exactly what you're going to be doing because I've seen you help people and especially, I don't know, because I've seen you help the elderly. I mean, is that the group of people that you go? Did you see that this is on trend in our own lazy reactor? And I'm sure maybe A.M. Caro has the same opinion that if you must beg, he should beg. If you must ask for help, he should ask. Now, what is my offense? Why must you guys focus only on me? Eh? What is my offense here? If on trending supported him to beg, A.M. Carroll supported him. You understand? So many of you guys supported him. Then why are you guys now forcing me to go towards your direction? Did I ever tell you guys 
you must support whatever I'm saying. I said, it's up to you. I was even apologizing. Maybe I was wrong. If you come back to say, you know what, Coco Mama, I feel this thing you are feeling. Or some of you guys said, I want you. Some of you guys said stuff like, oh, we saw this from the beginning. Oh, he has questions about this. Oh, he has this. I will still have to respect. Then if you come to tell me, you know what, Coco Mama, you're overreacting. I don't think he meant it. Somebody said that he actually did this for clicks. I'm clickbaiting. You guys know. Hey, hey, even this vlog I dropped yesterday. I clickbaited. <laughs> Lazy people everywhere. You guys should leave me alone. What is this? If you love me, hey, I forgot to remind you. I love you, Woto Woto. I love you like tomorrow, no day. Eh? But if you, you have a problem, you have. Guys, from yesterday I've lost 10 subscribers. Yes. And I know it's coming from Blazy Gang. For sure. Because Barwa Abi, of course, they, are, they subscribe to Coco Baba. Why they will subscribe when they are not even subscribed? So it's coming from you guys. Because you guys are bringing emotions to this. Me, if I'm going to subscribe from Baswa, he will lose 20 subs. I'm <laughs> guys, I am a street YouTuber. You know what it means? I started from scratch. No, I didn't have any umbrella. You see the way you guys saw Max One and all of you. I subscribe. Oh, Max One, girl, this. I was not spoiled like that on this space. I saw it all through. You know, if you have not gone to Facebook group or Telegram group to hustle for one case of, you will not understand. <laughs> if you have not done sub for sub. You give me, I give you. Baby, if you give it to me. <laughs> Some people will even give you 10 subscribers and collect it back. And meanwhile, you are genuinely giving them. <laughs> they, they are taking it from you. They give you. Like, <laughs> thread by butter thing. It happens here on this space. If you have not gone through that, you will not, you will not understand. So, I'm laughing. I know the importance of subscription. I, as a YouTuber, of course, if you are a non-YouTuber, you will connect differently. That's why I respect you guys. Whatever decision you have made, you feel like, oh, I'm done. Like, I almost lost my appetite yesterday. If I tell you how I felt yesterday, when I got that message from Mr. Fruits, you will not believe it because this is the highest person that Max One got. This is the highest person he got. This is his highest supporter. You understand? Even that toilet. I know now Maswan is saying, you know, Coco Mama said 300. Oh, it's 200. Is it 200 or 250? Maybe we need to go back to school and study this mathematics. You and I, Maxwan. But of us, our maths is not making sense. Honestly speaking, ha. Is it 250 or 200, Maxwan? Because both of us, our maths is not making sense. You are calculating the one that I mentioned. You forgot the way we started. <laughs> There's one adage in Nigeria that says, if you don't know where rain started beating you, you will not know where it leaves you. Eh? You are calculating, you forgot when we shared your story here. Was it 300 or not? Eh? You forgot that one. And you forgot that he actually gave you 200 US dollars. And sent another extra hundred and said, Modesta, take this for the cost and other things in order to transfer it. Actually, that hundred, I'm not supposed to give you the whole 300. I'm not supposed to, like, give you the whole 300 because that extra hundred, he said, he said for, you know, the cost of sending it to him. That was his message. It was clear. I actually sent that money sharp, sharp, even before YT dropped the money. So what are you calculating? You are only picking on uh, is two fifty, and I said three hundred. You are only picking on that. Huh? <laughs> what I want to say here is, let us just put emotions aside. If I was Max One, I would sit back, examine myself, and make some amendments. And this is all I do every day. If I can do it to others, why won't I do it for Max One? If my sister, even my mother. Have done something that I need to come here and address, and we are all on this space. I will freaking come here and talk about it. So Monica, Monica said, "Coco Mama, what about the video for today? It was up 24 minutes, then down. 
send his mother in hospital. I saw that notification. My mother is hospitalized. Just after he was robbed, in the middle of the night, mother is also hospitalized. So, <laughs> eh, so you guys, you think uh, you can only do this thing? Oh, he didn't beg. He did not use. No, there are so many ways to beg. You guys should stop this thing that you are saying. There are so many ways you can beg. You must not beg by saying, "Oh, please give me five hundred Kenyan shillings so that I will go and solve this problem." Oh, this one. No, 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 no. That is not how to beg. There was a time he took Mapopo for lunch. For him to do that, I wouldn't say he did it to activate donation. I'm just giving you guys different scenarios. Go back to his video and look at all these things. He didn't do it. I watched that video. In my mind, I know he did it to make Mapopo feel at home. We are not babies. Like, we work with our conscience. We are not babies here. We know what we are. When some of us that are, boom, like we are straight, you know some people, they see something, they ignore it. You understand? It, it, they will be like, okay, I'm not going to say anything, but I'll, of course, I will watch you from far. Or you are giving me this vibe. But they will not come out and say, oh, I'm dumb. Some people are like that. They will basically give you soft landing, meaning that you will not even know what is happening and the person is gone. Some of us, we are boom. So we need to respect each other like that. You understand? I did not overreact. I want to answer this lazy member that said, go back to watch. I did not overreact. I mean what I say and I say what I mean. You understand? And for me to say this, it means that I have observed it over and over and over and over and over hey, and over and over again. I've read in between the lines. Like that lunch that he went out with Mapopo. You will not say that he did it to activate donation or he wants people. But he got money doing that because people could see that, oh, Popopo was going through stuff and he took the initiative to bring him clothes, sit down with him, paid for his lunch. It's a good thing. You understand? He did it to make Mapopo comfortable. Mm -hmm. Anyway, that is that one. Olive, Olive Grace said, Coco Mama, don't you think you have overreacted? I prefer you go and watch Max One's explanation regarding the incidents of what really, of what transpired the other day. Then I told her that I'm going to talk about it today. Me, I don't think I overreacted. You guys should leave me alone. Leave me alone in my small corner. As I respect your opinion, respect mine now. Eh? Max One is still a lazy member. But I just take him as I take other villagers. Is there anything wrong in that? I am still subscribed to him. I am still watching him. Yesterday's video, he did. I watch it. If he drop another one, at my convenient time, I will watch. So what is the thing there? There's nothing. You guys should stop uh, bringing these sentiments for the last time. Let's just keep it like that. We are spiritual beings. So if my spirit is not coming together with yours, there's nothing I can do rather than to pull myself out. Like if I'm getting close to you, because you don't get close to people only when you see them physically. Even some of you guys here, we can relate differently. Something that made you to be supporting me. There might be something that made you to be listening to my tiny voice. There might be something that makes you to connect with me. You understand? from far so it's like that and when you have lost that when just like what fruit said that he was supporting marwa before and something happened he's no longer does it mean that marwa is not getting support from other people it's like that you guys should stop bringing too much emotions to it me i felt really bad yesterday when i got that message from mr fruit like i said I felt bad because I didn't want that to happen. But I had no choice but to come here and pour my heart. And I'm not going to say that he did it because of me. No. He did it because probably he also observed what I observed. And people, like I said, react differently. Mind you, he's not a YouTuber. He, he did what he wants to do. 
You people should respect that. Don't come under someone's comment and be attacking that person. Because if I notice this kind of a thing again, I might do something that the person will not like. You guys should respect each other's opinion. It's very, very important. Respect man as I respect yours. I am no Marwa. I didn't say go and unsubscribe to Max One. Stop watching Max One. No. Some of the lazy members there, they went there and they were throwing shades at me. I respect them. Is it not the best thing to do? That's the way to go. Now, let's move to the Virginia. Miki Miki, uh, Pamba, another baby official with uh, the Virginia. Four of them met up. The Virginia apparently came back from Nairobi. So they met up and did something like a chit chat. Can I call it a group collaboration? Anyway, let's watch them. Guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Hello Baby Official, right here. David Jr. <laughs> <laughs> yes, hi, good people. This is Pamba and Old, the one and only. Mick Mick. <laughs> <laughs> one family, uncle. One family. <laughs> one family. One nation. One nation. <laughs> Actually, I've noticed something. Let me see your hand. Hello, baby. Huh? Let me see your hand. Which one? Your hand like this. Yes, yes. Oh, you don't have for Tanzania. I for was Tanzania. thinking you had one for yes, Tanzania. Bring because I can one. see Mick Mick has one. Mm -hmm. The Virginia has two yeah. for one country. Why? We love USA. Okay, we the see. reason why I wear these bracelets, actually people have been really asking. Mm, two. It's because mm -hmm. I have solid support from this yeah. country and I have many friends from here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so yeah, that's the reason. The love is real mm -hmm. and true. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> you, you are doing that loving back. I know. <laughs> hey. Hey, hey. Mick, Mick must be enjoying yes. the love bag. You are you good at returning the love. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle, Uncle, you see today Mick, Mick is smiling. Why? Because I don't always smile. Yes. No, she like, does. like a previous does. day, you don't smile. Don't <laughs> I'm, I'm waiting for a smile until the end. Oh, <laughs> I always smile. Huh? I always smile. Mm. Mm -hmm. You know, when I'm up here to your video, mm -hmm. I will make you to smile a lot. I'll Every time. Tomorrow, okay? Tomorrow. Mm -hmm. We'll just wait. Oh, yeah, you'll be coming tomorrow. I will be waiting. <laughs> actually, I didn't know Mickey is hairy. You're very hairy by the way. Yeah. Like, oh, we are both uncle, hairy. Let me see hairy than him. Huh? Let me see the Virginians. Mickey is more. So, guys, what do you see here? For me, what I see here is a lot of pretense, okay? Hey, drama, drama, drama continues. The Virginia and Mickey Mickey are no longer together. Now, the Virginia is a little bit tensed. He was anxious. His appearance says a lot. Look at his facial expression. You can tell that he's not himself. And Mickey Mickey is more relaxed than him. Mickey Mickey is like moving on more than him. I feel like him, he's trying to take control of Mickey Mickey. Like he's trying to see if him coming close to Mickey Mickey will actually save his face. I don't know. And baby official, of course, is the person that he used to do this. Baby official, probably, probably, guys, nobody sent anything to me. This is my just assumption. Overthinking will not kill us in this case. So baby of official, who is close to the Virginia, probably reached out to Mickey Mickey and be like, what's up? Where are you? Let's meet up. Let's do stuff. And of course, Pamba was also in the village and they all met up. But the positioning like mickey mickey stayed far away from the virginia pamba was in between them is expected that's another sign the virginia cleaned up his community every video remember he used to share this girl that's why i feel like their friendship their coming together was purely for youtube growth because this girl came from nowhere like i said nobody knew her and of course she must be the one that reached out to the Virginia. Actually, she said that she reached out to the Virginia. Whether they tried to do something in between. But of course, you can tell that from the beginning, the Virginia was never interested. But what is happening here now is the Virginia is not happy that this girl is clapping back by coming back to his village to do stuff with other villagers. And Nasto, hey, that's why he is doing more of damage control. This is what I feel. I feel like he's a little bit worried that this girl is going to 
<laughs> hey, throw it out there. Either by collaborating with all these guys in the village. So, in order for him to control the situation, he's using his friend, Hello Baby. That's why Hello Baby kept telling Mickey, Oh, you look very happy now. Oh, before you are not smiling. You, of course, what do you expect from her when she's been treated anyhow? Of course, what do you expect from her when the movie is not being played out well? Like, she's always the one people are attacking. And Casta is the one that people are seeing that, oh, Casta is the best woman for the Virginia. Oh, Casta is the one that suits the Virginia. So you will not expect her to be happy with all that drama. That's why I feel like she's clapping back now, like coming out. Because anyway, she's out. People know her already. She's coming out to do more stuff. But the Virginia is anxious, anxious, anxious about this move of Mickey Mickey. Like, he didn't see it coming. Stella Muyimba did the same thing. You know, Stella Muyimba also seems like she paid the Virginia, okay? So when their contract expired, apparently, maybe, you know these people, probably the Virginia said stuff like, I'm done, I can't do this stuff again with you, I can't share you anymore, I can't collaborate with you anymore. The girl was still coming, like every now and then coming to Yabuhanze. It got to a point, she went to the site of Marwa, and the security guard there chased her away. <laughs> So, and then she stopped coming, like we've not noticed that she's still coming. Let's continue watching, guys. Since you went to Nairobi, mm -hmm. I'm so sad. Why? Wow. <laughs> because I miss your vibes. Hey. You know, during shooting video and vibing together, mm -hmm. always positive vibes. <laughs> what about you? Okay, that's too much on my face. <laughs> but it's true, David Jr. has the cool, coolest of the coolest vibes. You can easily, like, vibe with him. He has no problem being cool, you know, like that guy who is just cool and has no problem being cool, you know? That's the kind. What do you think? Mick, Mick. Yeah, of course. <laughs> what kind of answer is this one? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mick, what do you think? You saw how Pamba explained, oh, David Jr. has this coolest vibe. You know, you can easily vibe with him. Oh, you can <laughs> even Pamba. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> even Pamba. Her own explanation did not make sense to me. But Pamba at least did better than this girl, Mickey Mickey. Mickey Mickey was just laughing and saying, Yeah, because Mickey Mickey knows in her heart that this dude is freaking irritating. This dude is the worst human being you can do stuff with. This dude is the most stupid human being on earth. Delusional, delusional, paranoia is running in his veins like nothing else. Like if Mickey Mickey will open up and say her mind what she thinks about the Virginia, I bet you, hello baby will delete the video. Hello baby will not be able to upload this. But anyway, we can tell that um, this girl is moving on and she's moving on. The way I look at her, she's enjoying the fame like she's enjoying the attention because now what we're seeing now is we're seeing her with other ordinarily you will never see her with these guys she has been to that village when she was with the virginia how many times did we see her doing stuff that will tell you again the kind of person that virginia is control freak you know he isolates himself from every other person he feels superior to every other person in the village he isolates himself. He he shows up, but once in a while, that kind of a guy, because he feels that he's better than everybody. He has this big, huge following. Whole family is doing well on YT. They are, they have they are comfortable. They have their mansion. So he feels very very superior like that. And whoever that comes close to him, as a girlfriend, he will not even allow you to mingle as well. Again, a sign of a control freak. But. Now that they are no longer together, this girl is free. The other day she was with Nasto cooking and they did very well. The video went va. Of course, what do you think? Of course, what do you expect? Nasto loves to use people like that. Have you ever smelled his place? Why is he not cooking? Okay, even if you don't want to show your family, you don't want to show your children, Nasto, you don't want to show your wife, Nasto, so that nobody will throw them. At least, if you are filming, you can... Uh, Guys, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Huh? <laughs> At least you can stay in your environment and do stuff. And then you can film in your home without even showing your family. You can stay in one corner like Coco. 
you can do one corner corner already. You know what I mean? Forget about all these cock and bull stories. They know what they are doing. You know when they want to humanize, they will give every excuse to do what they want to do. Come out straight. Stop all this pretense. You know. You know what you are doing. You know you want this mola. You know you want the views to be dropped in. Me, I told you guys that there was nothing. Didn't I say it? I told you guys that this is all for content. In fact, all of them are suspects. You know, you know what I mean. Hey, greediness will not kill us in this space. Greediness. Mm. Now, the baby girl is on the loose to be doing stuff with everybody. Because guess what? She is free. She has graduated from school of David Junior. Hallelujah. I can't even wait the day that Casta will have her own graduation. Mm. The day that Casta will have her own graduation. That one. That one looks like the one that can run her mouth. Too. This uh, girl, she's still shying and shying. I'm sure she's talking in the background, okay? Uh-huh. But um, it is what it is. We are not asking anybody to come and open anybody's yash. But if they open it, why not? If we smell it, we will come here and let you guys know how it smells. Before, uncle, that is our job. Guys, <clears throat> one thing you people don't know is if you are dragging Coco Mama, you forget that you are giving me content. You drag me here, you push me to the wall, I will come here and pour it out to my people. And they will still come and support me. And at the end of the month, what will happen? <laughs> hey, you are enriching Coco Mama. You don't know. If you know, you know. So, those people dragging me, you know, calling me out. When this guy was doing all these things and praising me. Guys, there's another thing that he said that I want to address. Okay. Me calling him ungrateful doesn't mean. Let me tell you, there's what we call mouth service. You understand? You cannot come here and be saying, Oh, my sister Modesta. Oh, thank you so much, Mr. Fruits, for everything you are doing, for donating, for giving me money. Oh, you are saying all these things, but your action is saying something different. It doesn't go well. We are not children. So, you cannot say that, oh, but the other day you did a video thanking everybody, thanking your sister. You are still my sister. I am still your sister. But you cannot even take advice from your sister. You cannot even go out there and do something better. Eh? <laughs> sister, sister, is, 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 you are, okay, you are my brother now. But let me tell you the, how I feel. Let me tell you the truth, okay? Let's play that game that you want to play. Hey, my brother, Maswan. Hey, Maswan, you are still my brother. But I can no longer sit down and be accepting all this insult from everywhere, left, right, center, up and down, in Swahili. All I'm hearing, Coco Mama, Modesta Lifestyle, when I send the video somewhere, they're saying that, no, they are insulting you, that you are using Maswan. You are bringing division to your hands. I don't want to, and I don't want you to think that I reacted because uh, someone told me to react. If you feel I did that, Max, because people push me to do, then you are insulting me. Then you are now telling me that I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> I'm telling you, we don't react based on what people ask us to react. You react based on how that story or that content is related to you. What happened to the video of your mom being hospitalized? Why did you delete it? The inconsistency is smelling all over. Sit back and see these things. You and I, we know the truth. And it's only this truth will set us free. It doesn't mean that we will not support you. It doesn't mean that lazy members will not watch you. But just make some adjustment, make some amendments where it's necessary and put sentiments aside that's what we're saying baba marua is still threatening us with a lawyer marua action speaks better louder than words he took his community and he wrote this i'm not gonna read it out one demo how many times again yesterday he was live he was attacking even his own people hey guys 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 what do i want to say here we are waiting. Let me put it like that. Should be the lawyer is doing the investigation. We are waiting. Let the lawyer gather all the information. We are waiting, Marwa. And make sure you make it fast. You've been talking about this thing. 
Bring it on. A lot of people are telling you that you don't need to announce this anymore. Go low. Go quietly. That's how to run it. That's how big people run things. Go slow and go low. Type low and do your thing. And people will see the action. Coco Mama will be like, oh. <laughs> Guys, I received a letter from Marwan's lawyer <laughs> for defamation of character. <laughs> Oh, guys, I need a lawyer. <laughs> because Marwa came for me. <laughs> I don't know what to do again. <laughs> International police is looking for me everywhere. Interpol. <laughs> hey, the lawyer. Oh, how many lawyers did you buy? <laughs> how many lawyers? Make sure you pay them very well so that they will give you a better job. You know, law. <laughs> Lawyers, they like it big. They want to... <laughs> hey! <laughs> Lawyers are not cheap. I'm telling you. So if you want to get a lawyer, make sure you get the one that will not come and make your own situation worse. I'm very, very serious. <laughs> hey! Guys, <laughs> I see reaction. Reaction must continue. I don't want to. You guys, you know already. I try not to bring Marwa here every day because he can keep draining my energy and your energy. Like every day, all you are hearing from Coco Mama. Like every day when you click on my video, you see Marwa, 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 Marwa. You'll be like, ah, uh ah, -uh, Mama, what's going on? We're tired of this dude. Can you give us other juicy content? Okay, if you don't know what to do, at least hit the dance floor for us. <laughs> Or cook some Nigerian emotic food for us. You guys, <laughs> um, I don't know what to say, but we are waiting. You understand? <laughs> Let him do his thing. We are waiting. Anywhere Marwa calls me, I will come. <laughs> hey. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Dim Wango is in Germany, at least. Because I know you are also after Black Beauty. What prevented D from starting? D is in Europe as we are talking. Why are you guys not doing things the way you're supposed to do? D even passed through Qatar. Eh? <laughs> guys, D was on transit. D went to Europe through Qatar Airways. I'm not joking. D was on transit in this country. Like 15 minutes away from Coco. <laughs> They don't know where they are. If you don't know where you are, ask questions. Where am I? Why am I even here? What am I? What's my purpose of coming to this place? What am I doing? Why are people talking about me? What did I do to these people that are on my case like this? Did I say anything to them? Have I ever done anything to them? They just started, you know, talking about me. Marwa, we are waiting, you know. Make it fast. On a serious note. Bring it fast, fast, so that the show will continue. Dim Wango. Yay! Guys, I want to share one picture here, and you tell me what you think. When Dim Wango did collaboration with Black Forest Princess, they were all complaining of how cold Europe is, the weather, okay? And how can you stay with a married person? Like, a married person, a married woman, aboard you as a single girl in her home with her husband and you will come and dress like this guys look at this picture and tell me what you think who are you showing this belly who are you trying to impress eh d get some class now this thing is not looking it's not it's not funny at all when you come to someone's home you have to dress decently especially if you are going to be around you know this person, you will not say that this person is your relative. You will not say that actually you are the one invited. Like, if you are in your home, you can do what you like. You can go naked. You can, whatever, like, whatever. But you, if you have visited someone, you need to respect that person. Especially when you know that this person is a married person. And you know men. You know men. You guys. <laughs> men, they too believe in what they are seeing. 
you understand? <laughs> they too believe in the sight more than the mind. That's why sometimes a man will do something. It, of course, it can happen to a lady also. So I don't like when I'm giving all these instances here. It will be like, hey, why is she always attacking men? But most of the times, all these earthly things, you will do it because of your sight. It comes out from your sight. And once your sight clears, your mind will be like, but what did you do? Why did you even go like this? Then regret do what will set in. You can't come to someone's home. You are dressing all naked, showing your belly, you know, showing your curves. Imagine if her belly is like this. Bum bum, everything is outside. Who are you trying to impress? You are there as a content creator. I'm not saying that she must not dress good. It's not even like her dressing is uh, top notch. It's not even like her dressing is uh, something serious. You guys should leave me alone. Let me be keeping it real. Because I know some of you, uh, some, someone was like, why do you, you guys should leave me. Leave me alone. Let me be saying it water water. Let me say it the way I feel. I don't want, I don't want lazy people everywhere. Leave me in my small corner. Let me drop it water water as it is. So I reacted on this video last time and someone dropped a comment that was like, why are you attacking this young girl, you old woman? Um, um, D was right. A lot of Nigerians are coming to Kenya, but no Kenyan is going to Nigeria. Who told you that there are no Kenyans in Nigeria? If, if, if Kenyans are not going to Nigeria, are they not going to other countries? This Germany that D went to, is it not a Kenyan that have brought her there? Where I am now, do you know how many Kenyans that are here? You guys should be receiving sense with all this emotion. What I'm saying is, there are good and bad people everywhere. Don't come because you have mingled with few Nigerian guys that are struggling, like, to make both ends meet. You feel like you can use that to address the Nigerian men. How many Nigerians? Do you know? Do you know the field? Do you know the caliber of men from Nigeria? You've not. How many? How many of them have you seen? So that was why I reacted the way I reacted because. She came for Nigeria men. I had to come also hard on her. But these people saying, oh, Nigerians are going to Kenya, but Kenyans are not going to Nigeria. They're not going to Nigeria, but they're freaking going to other places. So stop it. People go to where they want to go. And who told you that there are no Kenyans in Nigeria? I can decide to move to Kenya. It doesn't mean that Kenya is the best place. But it's just that maybe visiting there, I felt like settling down. I felt connected. So you can migrate. You can go to anywhere that you feel comfortable to live you can make anywhere your home to stop bringing all these emotions you bring reaction channel is not a channel that will come and be sugarcoating you know you see something you will be like oh let me say it this way so that the people will like me oh so that they, anybody watching me will subscribe nah nine <laughs> it doesn't work like that guys before we call it a day lost Haiti is Marwa's ex-girlfriend like they had a video that went viral Marwa was all over her kissing her and all that and now it seems like dude swap girlfriend with his best Erondante hey and why are they abandoning Erondante like Erondante looks so down 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 I'm asking myself is it not better for this dude to come out now and talk he needs to speak up how can you be with your bestest girlfriend, ex-girlfriend? Because you guys know that Marwa will, anywhere he is, like now that he's in Mexico, we are seeing him with this Muzungu lady already. Like, I'm like, so this, 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 so this thing has gotten to this level and you expect people not to talk about it. Anyway, it's not even a news again that Marwa is changing women anywhere he is. It's no longer a news. But why this one raised my eyebrows is because this girl has done stuff with Marwa and now hanging out with Erondante. How can these people do these things on camera? So this video was shared six months ago, apparently before Christmas or something. And let's watch guys. 
What did you do? We we're about to buy a Christmas tree for my Airbnb. Oh, yeah. Ah, yeah. So he just invited me over and he wants to get a Christmas tree. So we are on the place just trying to get something that's very nice, true. very beautiful. That's not true, fam. She's, she's, she's making that up. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not. Okay, look, look at those. Wow, look at that. Christmas is here. So Christmas is like a huge holiday in Colombia. Yeah. Oh. We really, re really, really love Christmas. So this is tree number one. But I too big? Okay. I mean we just can keep on looking at something. So my friend Aaron he wants to get a Christmas tree. Guys, this is a really nice place. I mean when you are in Ambigado you can come to different places and we are at home center so we're definitely just gonna be checking on what we're we going to do. Today is like a Christmas shopping day, so we're gonna be here and yeah. This was during Christmas, okay? They did this video together. Do you celebrate Christmas with who? Of course, someone special to you, your loved ones, family, you know, relatives, close friends, you understand? I'm not saying there's anything wrong with them going for Christmas shopping together. Out of all people, Arondante is the one getting close to Marwa's ex-girlfriend. Because this girl is from Colombia, okay? And she has done stuff with Marwa, like she used to be Marwa's close, close girlfriend. Like, so why is it now that this girl is spotted with Erondante? I don't get it. They are not even hiding it. So, someone dropped a comment for her and was like, I know Marwa is the one that helped you open your YouTube channel. Do you keep in touch with him? She didn't answer. She didn't bother to answer because it's. It's obvious that they are no longer together. Now, you ask yourself a question. If you are a normal person, why would someone you have dated prefer to go for your friend? This thing has happened repeatedly. This is not, this is not the first time we are seeing something like this. You remember Paulina? Hey, I can smell Paulina's situation in this case. As soon as Paulina got to America and she spotted this Ivan, she changed her mind. Okay? This girl was with Marawa. They did video. We were trying to look for that video, but I couldn't see it. Where there were viral video where they were kissing on camera. I couldn't find it. Now, this girl that you have been with is now very close to your friend. Up to December. Like, this is the one that they are showing us. What is happening in the background, we don't even know. And guys, remember when Marawa went to US and Rondante went to Philippines? What do I smell then? He was avoiding to meet Marwa. Is it making sense to you or not? He was avoiding like, oh, this parasite. I don't wanna, I don't wanna. I'd rather travel out. So when Marwa left US, he came back from Philippines. I'm talking about Erondante. Now Erondante is busy with Marwa's ex. And this girl is not even hiding it. Like she's coming out to do stuff with Erondante. Mm -hmm. Could that be another reason why they are no longer together? Like. We're, we're seeing that it's as if there's something going on between Marwa and yes, Have you seen why Marwa made that statement that among all his friends that the only person that he can do stuff with is Mutua? That all his friends, they always want what he wants. They always go after his women. <laughs> and we thought that he was referring to only Ivan. Now, can you put one or two together to see why Marwa made that kind of statement? Can he now examine himself and see why this thing is happening to him rather than just running his mouth and getting a lawyer? Get a lawyer! Freaky! Get a lawyer! So what, if you want to buy 50 lawyers, what is preventing you? We are ready for you. We are waiting for you. Anywhere you call us, we will answer. Sharp, sharp! If you watch till this moment, you know who you are. You are the best. You are the bestest. Without you guys. Coco Mama will be gone. Uh, this one that they are dragging me. If I go up, they drag me. If I come down, they drag me. Uh, hey, guys, if I ever bring anybody from me, your hands are here to you guys. You guys should come anywhere you are. Look for me and give me a hot slap. Slap me. I said it. If I ever bring somebody from your hands and be like, oh, guys, this person, please support our own. I'm not saying Kenya. In your hands, I'm not gonna use what is happening in one area. You know, 
most Kenyans that I've met here, even when I ask them, do you know where is your one? They'll be like, Kenyans. So I'm not going to use what is happening in a small localized area to judge the whole nation. Nay, nay. And I'm not going to change my personality because this is me. Hey, <laughs> my emotions are always out. People can tell, can tell through my eyes the kind of person that I am. I don't hide my emotions. This is me. Take me the way I am or you leave me. Freaking leave me alone. Leave me. It's as simple as that. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Bring someone to bring another one to bring another one. Hey, bring someone to tell me, let's get this ministry running. I'll see you in my another photo. Peace out, peace out, peace out, peace out, peace out. Peace out, peace out. Bye bye, bye guys. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.